a group Youth for Peace and Development in the Niger Delta has passed a vote of confidence on the Executive Vice President, Nigerian National Petroleum Company Limited, Tombomi Adoke, describing him as a man of integrity who has contributed to the development of the Niger Delta region in Nigeria. President of the group, Prince Jude Ubaka, made the disclosure at a media briefing in Abuja, Nigerian's capital city. The president also called on the Economic and Financial Crime Commission, EFCC, to disregard the petition alleging that Tombomie Adeoke is involved in crude oil bunkering and theft. Looking the antecedent of, of raising profiles of our amiable brother, Mr. Tombomie Adoki, whom rose from ordinary manager to general manager, Crude Oil Market Division, and subsequently to the position of the Executive Vice President, Nigeria National Petroleum Company Limited, has done tremendously with true competence, honesty, character, and loyalty to promote the vision and mandate of NMPCL. Sequel to a petition of allegations of bunkering and crude oil theft, as well as instigation of our youth to stage a mega protest in our region as alleged by fraudulent group called Niger Delta Youth and Stakeholders Congress is totally baseless. It's a blackmail and a mere propaganda sponsored by evil elements to tarnish the good reputation and raising profile of Mr. Kambuye Adoki. Without fear or favor, we want to state categorically that Mr. Adoki has well as, as we all know, is the only genuine Niger Delta son that has been doing everything humanly possible to stop the activities of pipe bunkering, pipeline, vandali by, by, pipeline <laughs> vandalism, and oil theft in the region. Chairman, Board of Trustees of the group, Comrade Opoma Joseph, appealed to the Niger Delta youth to join hands with leaders from the region to bring development to the area. He also appealed to those writing petition against the executive vice president of the NMPCL to publish an apology on National Daily. If you can, as far as we are concerned, they say charity begin at home. If we have people like Adoke, like five in Noba in the Niger Delta region, Niger Delta would have been a better place for every one of us to stay. But I think I want to advise I want to use this opportunity to advise our people to call our youth to order. These symptoms of pulling down, I think, is enough. We stop all this kind of black, you know, of black like me. I don't care if somebody that have a, a power our youth in, ver in various areas. So it's not it's not somebody because. When he was in, he's a man, no. you can go to NFPC and investigate him. He, he's a civil servant. So whoever that is sponsoring these people, we are giving them the last warning. They should apologize to him. With, you know, with national newspaper, they should apologize to him. So that Nigeria will know that that man is, you know, is an innocent. So we are Youth for Peace and Development in Niger Delta is a non-political organization that advocates for the rights and development in the Niger Delta region of Nigeria. Emmanuel Unu, News 24.